here we are is the red pyramid head thing in all its glory so this is made by a british company called numskull under license by konami so it's an official product and it stands at 29.5 centimeters tall and the shipping weight is 1.4 kilos so it's an awesome statue if you're going to display it on your shelf guys just be careful because this stick does stick out quite far so you're going to have to push it back a bit and that's the ideal girlfriend there just two legs and a pussy this is actually the third release in the silent hill numbskull series the first one was the bubblehead nurse and the second one is over here it's the heather mason statue which we'll get onto next and this is the latest one so i really like this helmet here it looks really dirty disgusting weathered in fact it looks like my own helmet the original creator of this character is a japanese guy he's called mashihiro ito and he wanted to create a monster with a hidden face and he was unhappy with his original designs because they resembled humans wearing masks so he then drew a monster with a premium shaped helmet which was what we have today and yeah he just uh, i think he really sort of hit a home run with this really according to ito the triangle sharp right and acute angles suggest the possibility of pain as a german world war ii tank enthusiast ito was inspired by the lower hull of the king tiger heavy tank when designing the edges of the character's helmet other military vehicles from the region and era in form design elements as well so this is all one piece here so this statue is attached to the base and these legs are attached to the base these three spears they are loose so you've got to attach them on by yourself these sticks here they took me about 30 minutes to get into place and to be honest i'm still not sure i've done it right so this was a bit difficult to set them up and we've got the little shackles there this is the back side of the character so he's got a um, blood-stained cape there he's got massive guns look at those triceps looks huge puts me to shame and uh, yeah we've got this little pus bit at the back of his neck that looks pretty gruesome got some cuts on his body I really like this statue, it's pretty cool. So I'll just zoom in again. Now, there was actually a bit of beef between Christopher Gans, who was the director of the Silent Hill movie, and Ito. So Christopher Gans, he suggested Pyramid Head was one of the executioners in the original history of the town, and that it's not one particular or exclusive manifestation of him as an entity however ito he rejected this suggestion stating they really misunderstood pyramid head i designed that only for james in october 2022 it was revealed that pyramid heads executioner background was inspired by the characters in the 1995 film braveheart but guys if you do get the opportunity to pick up this figure i would recommend it it's a awesome statue and it pairs quite well with the bubblehead nurse and yeah it's just very detailed it's got some awesome paint work and it just looks awesome so guys thanks for watching if you like this video please like comment and subscribe thank you